he played, I think he started every game for Munster and the way he plays the game is, is I think, speaks for itself. So it's great to have him here. Yeah, no, you are right, and that was a very tough thing for me, especially not being able to play for the sport <coughs> box, you know. Um, but it was also the thing that, that drove me to, to get myself better and get back to being on field and um, get myself to a place where I can be, you know, back here. Ja, yeah, dit is uh, dit is baie lekker om terug te wees en dit is uh, dit is eerlijk waar voorreg om by die bokke te wees en dit, dit is iets wat mens besef as jy nie is nie, jy weet, en mens Mens moet dit nie, uh, <coughs> mens moet dit nie licht vat om hier te wees nie, en um, ek is baie blij vir Jaker dat hy ook hier is, dit is, dit is vir my lekker dat hy hier is, want hy het, uh, hy het redig oor die laaste paar jaar goeie seisoen gehad, en um, hy het oor die afgelope seisoen elke game van Manster gestart, en uh, ek dink die manier waar hy die game speel, jy weet, is vanzelfsprekend, en, en ek is blij dat hy um, gerekenaas word vir dit. Ik vraag gewoon over die Afrikaans, Ja, die belangrijke van die kamp is, is, is natuurlijk ons bereid voor voor wereldbeker en uh, weet, as, as stap op pad in die wereldbeker toe. Ne? Die eerste keer is, is kampe geweest, maar na die kampe is actually rugby championship games wat ons moet speel in die eerste in Australië teen Eddie Jones, wat hy uitgeslapen coach is, wat nou Australië coach is, wat hy Engeland gecoach is, maar actually was laatste toets wat ons gespeel, en was teen Eddie, eerste toets weer, is teen Eddie in Australië. Uh, um, so in die opzicht is, ons is, uh, ons is waar ons wil wees, ons het een groot squad, als so vier of vijf van die spelers wat beseer is, um, uh, en dan die belangrijkheid vraag hy van, hoe moest die lauwe oos John Klein, is gerecht? Ja, hoe moest John Klein, um, weer in die regulatie van andere regulatie ook, uit al die lande, ja, weet daar, kon bijdraan, sê, hoe voel hulle oor, ons het die teen het uh, gestem, uh, maar dan, toe wereld waar ek die besluit maak, het, toe, dan ga kijk, kijk hulle natuurlijk, waar is hulle bykie dun, waar is ons dat die keer, bykie uh, manier op ons speel, wat is speelers vat bykie hemmering, en waar redelijk baie beseer, en slot is een van die posities, uh, net manier hoe ons speel, en, en, en miskien visies is, en uh, Jean Klein is beskikbaar en van ons geweerde die regulatie het verander en Jack en die coach is al hulle begin trek en roadmaps op die ouwens doen en hy is een van die uitblinkers gewees en ja, een of twee beserings en uh, ons slot stok klik like, eerst klik baie baie goed maar ons weet, daar is nog 6 toetsen voor die World Cup so dit kan baie gaan verander Geet jou, 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 jou inzet oor op die video denk jy Afrikaans te doen? Ja, uh, um, uh, jy vraag my as director of rugby, wat ek aan my opinie gee, en, en dit is altyd iets wat ou, altyd ten sterkste uh, kon dit nie is, wat hy iemand wil probeer, wat ons denk jy het is nodig hee, ons denk jy vir iemand om enige, uh, enige iets te gebruik wat, om, wat, wat onverantwoordelik en, en onvettig en ten die regulaties is en, en verbode is, ons denk jy het is nodig in, in, in rugby nie, want jy sien klein ookie soos Cheslin Colby, wat so, so skirtlie en haar oos wat hy net absoluut maak, wat miskien nie die grootste is nie so, um, weer eens, en daardoor sê ek nie op jy hoe uh, is enigszins, um, ek, ek oordeel jy oor om nie, en dit is maar net een waarschuwing vir enige oukie wat al buiten is om, om, om mooi te dink, uh, en dan om my aan te sluit, het was nie een dag wat ons in kamp is, wat voorbij gaan wat, wat op hierdie vlak wat jy nie getoets word nie, so uh, selfs ons wat het oorweeg is net uh, baie stupid, want hulle gaan op die moment uitgevang word, uh, omdat het so baie toetsing is, en dan om haar pibie te terugkom self, um, en ek weet baie mense stem nie saam met die ring, en wie is miskien meer persoonlijke opinie, is dat ek glo in tweede kanse, ek glo as hy over vier jaar uh, geskoors is, um, dan was haar rede ook al vier jaar in hy tydperk is, en hy het vir sy, hy het die prijs betaal, maar ons hoop hy kom terug, hoop hy speel skitterend vir die sjaaks, en ons hoop ons kan meenaam vir die bokke kies.
Herr Gref, I can ask you if you weigh up competition for starting places, not necessarily starting places, but places in the squad at lock. How does that compare now to what it was four years ago for you? Well, I think um, the, the most important thing in this squad is we all understand our role and you know, uh, we work towards that and we work well together as well to to strengthen each other and to, you know, the competition between us is actually great because I think it brings the best out of us um, and that will only allow us to be to be better, you know. So I don't know if, if that answers your question, but yeah. <laughs> Ja, dit is, dit is obviously iets wat dier jou kop gaan, jy weet, maar soos ek vroeger gesê, dit is nie, dit is nie jou recht om hier te wees nie, dit is voorrecht om hier te wees en dit is nie, dit is nie makkelijk om hier te wees nie, maar die lekker ding van om voor hier nie te gewees het is, jy weet wat het vat om hier te wees, so um, ek, het, ek weet, as ek hard genoeg werk en hard genoeg speel, um, dan hoopelijk krijg ek weer die geleentheid. Competition, uh, it's a, um, how are you enjoying the competition that you're having with, with Steven Kitts, especially with how well you two guys played throughout the URC? I mean, <clears throat> it's not really, I wouldn't say it's, it's a competition, we just merely try to help each other. I mean, uh, watching Steven play for the Storm is, actually pushes me to actually get better. So I enjoy that. I mean, he's a quality player, he's already won a World Cup. So it's something that I aspire to as well. It's like, I see what he does and I try to do it as good as he does or better. So it's a great, like it just, you know, you just go as a player naturally. And so, yeah, I enjoy that really a lot. And also, your coach is saying you guys are solely focused on that first task against Australia. The reality is that in the back of your minds, um, Atlas minds, you guys are probably looking ahead to that big assignment in France. The competition will get much bigger internally in that squad, is Oh, uh, I get you, but uh, I mean, you climb a mountain step by step, really. So, like, we have to do all well now in the championship so we can build momentum to the World Cup. As much as it is in the back of our minds, but we know we have a task ahead. Like, you have to play well now. You have to show that you're actually good enough to actually make that squad in the end. So I think that's the most important for us now. It's like taking these matches step by step, week by week, and, you yeah, when we get when we get to a cup so we can be ready and you know face the challenge then. Okay. Um being at the national setup for four years, you know, that's a a lot can change in that time, but has it helped you that there's quite a bit that's still the same, you know, basically your whole locking department's very similar to the twenty nineteen World Cup. Has that helped you ease back in easier? Yeah, it's definitely um it's it's easier to come back into a system and you've worked with guys before and and you know them though so they, they actually got me up to speed pretty quickly, you know, so I'd, I'd say that's the biggest difference for being away so long is, is that, uh, you know, connection with other guys. And uh, Ox, obviously, uh, you know, uh, dropping out of the URC quite early is disappointing for a lot of the guys, but has it helped you guys being involved in the Springbok camp here from early, from Durban to, to Cape Town, now here, has that helped uh, give you guys uh, quite a bit of momentum, you know, after dropping out of the competition so early? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, you get aligned much more, but like, it's always like better. You want to be aligned all together. So as much as you kind of see, you see the pictures that the coach is trying to give you, and you obviously want to improve on that, but like the, seeing the whole picture come together is actually like, that's when you actually understand your role within the system. But yeah, it has helped in like, in what, understanding what the coaches are trying to achieve and our way forward.